WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman, Tiger Financial News Network, 11 o'clock news update. We're looking at the Dow 201 at 35,429. New recovery high, very good action. Nine over the 14. MACD is good. Stochastics flat at 92%. This is good action. Looking at the S&P, we're looking at the S&P. Not quite so good, but still up 19, almost 20 at 45.56. Also above the nine, but getting closer to testing the nine support and the nines over the 14. MACD is starting to weaken, but still good. Stochastic starting to weaken, but still good at 84%. I'm watching the next coming days. The 44, 82-ish area will be key. 44, 82. No, 40, 45, 28 will be the first big support that it needs to hold. If there's any pullback, QQQ index 100 is trading right now up 56 cents at 376.21. Kind of struggling actually. Well, it's also to do with the rebalancing, etc. But at 376.07. Uh, if it starts to trade under 368 at any point in the next week, that says, oops, got a little digestive phase going on, but the weekly chart is still very strong. IWM has come back a little bit. No, it's still down a penny at 194.45. Uh, holding okay, but uh, and that weekly chart has improved quite a lot. We're looking at gold. Gold is trading down uh, about three at 1964. Digestive phase after this peak D was made. Um, I think that it's not going anywhere right now. Oh, I didn't do this during my show. I meant to do it. The dollar, the DXY, trading at this particular point up. Why does that not go? There it is. Dollar is up uh, 29 ticks at 101.35. The, the, the dollar has a chance, and I said to, to my subscribers to my opening call, we are still long for, from 2018. Uh, we're looking at the dollar. It has a chance to get to the 101.58, 101 101.62 area. At that point, we'll see if it can continue rallying. And if you're looking at the USD, JPY, this is the yen. Also had a very good move, pulling back a little bit today. If you're looking at the EURUSD, which is a euro dollar currency pair, sharp move to the downside. And that's just suggesting that maybe we're going to see a little bit of weakness sometime this week in the general stock market bonds. Uh, bonds are uh, down 230 seconds. They're trying to rally. They're really struggling. So yields are kind of at the higher range. And if you're looking at crude oil, it's done very nicely. It's up $1.45. Uh, stay tuned. Great program here at TFNN. Check out my opening call daily newsletter, and I'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day.